Hi, my name is Rin Caputo, and I'm CEO and co-founder of Caputo Brothers Creamery in Spring Grove, Pennsylvania. Thank you so much for selecting us for our third year in the top 100 of the FedEx Small Business Grant. I have to tell you, every year when the announcement comes along that you guys are open for applications, not only do we get excited, but our entire community here in Pennsylvania rallies around us. They go on, they vote. We even had some folks this year talking about how they set their timer to make sure that every 24 hours they were able to vote. So it's really been a great opportunity for us to rally the community around us. And right now, it's more important than ever. As you might remember, we're the people who are trying to revolutionize the way that mozzarella is made in America. We learned this craft in Italy. We have a small artisan mozzarella making business here in Pennsylvania, and we supply some of the best restaurants in the country. And we do that using FedEx, by the way. So it's always been really exciting, this adventure that we've been on, teaching people about what makes our mozzarella different. No vinegar, no citric acid, just real cheese. But in the past year, something additional has come along and, and made our mission that much more important. I always say that our number one priority and passion is revolution, revolutionizing mozzarella. But right now, we have a secondary passion and quite frankly, by the day, it seems to be taking over. See, in 2018, in Pennsylvania, we lost 370 dairy farms that closed for good. Just last week, we lost another eight. That's eight farms, family farms, that closed, and this weekend we'll be selling their herds. Why are these farms closing? Quite simply put, the conventional price of milk. The amount of money that these farmers are earning for their milk is actually less than what it cost them to produce the milk on their farm. Now, over the years, the price of milk goes up and it goes down, and usually the dairy farmers are able to weather the storm and the bad times. But this cycle has gone on much, much longer than usual, and to be honest, there's no end in sight. What we do here at Caputo Brothers Creamery is we actually pay double, sometimes more, depending on where the price of milk is, than the conventional dairy price. It's important to us, and it has been since the beginning, that we pay dairy farmers a fair and living wage so that they can be profitable and sustainable. In November, we were able to save a dairy farm five weeks before they closed. Now that this dairy farmer's been on board with us since November, just a few weeks ago, they bought the first new tractor they've had in years. And Dan, the dairy farmer said to me, you can't imagine what it's like to be able to go out every morning at 3.30 in the morning when you're milking cows and know that you have a tractor that's gonna start and that you're gonna be able to get through your day seven days a week because you have that piece of equipment. Even more importantly, can afford healthcare again can afford to take care of themselves in a way that they haven't been able to. Every week, once or twice a week, we have dairy farmers coming through our door because they know that we pay more money for the milk that we process here and begging us to take on their farm. The challenge is we only have so much capability or capacity here in the current plant. And so what we need is this grant from FedEx to actually expand. Specifically, this would allow us to add on an aging cave and we would partner with a local brewery to create a cheese that would be very marketable. And we already have a customer here locally who said they'll buy pretty much everything we can make. That one expansion would allow us to save two, three, maybe even four dairy farms this year. So please consider Caputo Brothers Creamery for this opportunity for this amazing grant. Thank you for continuing to inspire us each year and for everything you do for small businesses.